Welcome back. We're here looking at the uh, energy market, and this is going to be my daily forecast for Tuesday, December 6, 2022. If you like to support the channel, you will hit the subscribe button down here in the corner, hit the like button and bell button to see our new videos, and you're welcome to join us over at Patreon, where you can get our full analysis and, and more. So let's start by looking at the uh, WTI oil. And as you can see, this has been a horrible day for the energy market. The oil is down, or WTI oil is down more than 3%, and natural gas is down by more than 10%. So, yes, um, price cap for Russian oil came into effect today, and it technically rallied at the beginning of the session, and then it just fell apart. So, if you scroll out and look at this uh, from, basically, soon now, this is not looking good for uh, the energy market and it's kind of screaming um, but basically the market is basically screaming that we'll see a recession for the world economy uh, going forward and that is uh, very likely at this point so if you look at where we are finding massive resistance we can see that the 50 is where we find resistance 20 as well 200 200 and yet again 20 are breaking down so we are definitely in a downtrend and every rally especially up towards the 200 when we average has been sold into quite aggressively and the same goes for today where we're down more than three percent so question is where we are going at this point so there are a few uh, levels that are, were significant prior to the coronavirus and have been significant in the past as well so one is down here at the 66 and we can scroll out uh, even further and we can see that this area here where we used to trade roughly at $10 interval is down at roughly 51 and all the way up towards uh, 64. This was for a really long time where oil uh, traded from uh, give or take all of 2019 on towards uh, 2020. And we did pass this and then we just went bananas in 2021. But since then we have basically broken down. But if we are heading into a recession, then we may see that this market drop significantly lower towards uh, probably uh, 28 to $35 uh, a barrel, which is fairly usual uh, for a recession period before it basically bottoms. So if we look at technical indicators, we can see the MACD is bearish. The CASIC is bearish and RSI is also bearish, but we are getting very close to being oversold. So there's probably not a lot of room to the downside before we see another rally, but we're going lower and lower in this market. So let's look at natural gas. Natural gas just fell off a cliff. It gapped down, rallied, and then just dropped even further. At this point, it looks like we are going to target the lowest yet again down here at 4.7. And even though that we're heading into the period of the year where you usually see these kinds of rally, we are basically falling. And that is probably because there is going to be excess supply of natural gas, also oil, as demand will basically evaporate going forward. So MACD is basically bearish, stochastic is bearish, and RSI is also bearish, and there's quite a lot of room to the downside. So at this point, it looks like 4.7 is gonna be the target. To the upside, 50 moving average is um, going to be resistant, and so is going to be the 200 moving average. So any rally up towards this point will most likely get uh, get sold into, and also the 200 moving average will most likely also get sold into. So hope you found this helpful. You will support your channel by subscribing, hit the like button, and follow the CR news videos, and please do your own due diligence before trading in the markets. Good luck, and thank you very much.